What's this? A text from Anthony of Unconventional Aquatics? Let's check this out. $3. Zach, this is but, great, uh, man, but no, there's no, something, you know what, we, fish Zach, fish I'm sending, really I gotta send you a video message. Oh, is this thing on? Is it, we're on, we're rolling. Zach, this is an SOS emergency message. An SOS emergency message. Zach, the feeding videos are sick, bro, but do you, your awesome viewers know about all the sick catfish you have? Why aren't you showing them, Zach? Why aren't you feeding these amazing catfish? If I didn't know any better, bro, I think you were scared of your catfish. Are you scared of your catfish, Zach? I want to see you feed your catfish. People want to see. Well, you know what this means. We've got to make a video. So as you can see, we are inside and it is dark. But... Unconventional Aquatics brings up a pretty valid question, and that is, uh, am I scared of my catfish? Maybe. <laughs> but, uh, you know, when someone calls you out like this, when someone challenges you, you know, whether you're afraid or not, you gotta just get in there, you gotta tackle it head on, get face to face with it, and say, you know what? I'm not afraid of you. I'm not afraid of you. So, all fun aside, I do really appreciate Anthony over at Unconventional Aquatics challenging me to make this video. Uh, he and I have actually talked about Catfish can be pretty hard to feed. Not because they don't eat, but just because when you're trying to film them, they there are a number of challenges that uh, come along with that. So let me show you some of the uh, challenges with trying to do a feeding video on catfish. A lot of times, you put the food in for the catfish, and some of your other fish in the tank have other ideas. Sometimes, your catfish can be a little camera shy. Other times, your catfish will just eat the wrong stuff. Let me know down in the comments what struggles you have when you feed any of your fish because these are mine in all honesty guys i've mentioned it before i'm becoming somewhat of a catfish addict i've got a pretty unique collection with some rare some big exotic stuff but i'm realizing you know even just shooting this video that catfish have so much personality and they can be some of the most rewarding fish to have and to feed and they can give you some truly awesome experiences. So these next couple of clips are showing you, you know, it could be really awesome to do a feeding video on catfish. It's as simple as that. So let's check those out.
That was actually the first time I've ever hand fed that wall ago. So, uh, that's actually pretty sweet. I'm uh, super glad I got that on camera. I might have to actually use my fingers uh, next time because he uh, clearly trusts me. But uh, moving on to the next size up. Didn't like the touching. We're going to go ahead and wrap this video up. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun filming this one. A huge thank you to Anthony over at Unconventional Aquatics for challenging to make this video with that uh, while ago hand feeding, you know, getting clips of the arowana stealing the food off the red tail and that gulper feeding. I got some experiences that I honestly wouldn't have without him asking me to make this video. So thank you to him. Again, if you are not already subscribed to Unconventional Aquatics, definitely check him out. He is one of the most genuine, enthusiastic, and passionate YouTubers that I know. He has pool ponds, he has native fish, bass, catfish, he's got it all. So definitely go check him out, let him know that SC sent you. But hopefully you enjoyed this one. Until the next one, I will see you soon. I have to go get it. Now we make a video.